What's going on, everybody? This is Joe. And Amy. And we are back with another episode of Pokemon Diamond, Amy's fourth journey through the world of Pokemon. Last time, our screen looked very different uh, because Joe finally figured out how to use our shit. Uh, but also, we did some stuff. We have a team of Pokemon. Geodude, Zubat, Badoo, Krikatot, Shinx, and Piplup. And yes, I'm aware that the second screen is... Uh, slightly very stretchy yeah <laughs> i did that on purpose it, it's our main screen is much bigger now it should be easier to see um so hopefully that's a little bit better we we prefer it this way personally yeah. so um anyway so amy this is what uh, our team looks like we kind of discussed it at the end of the last episode a bit but why don't you remind folks uh, either if they forgot or in case they didn't see um what is going on with uh some of our team here so, uh, last time we caught Zubat and Geodude, um, basically for the sake of having a full team for the gym, um, I don't intend to keep these two, um, but I think Geodude will be helpful in a rock-type gym because he, or she, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Geodude is a she in this one. <laughs> uh, so because she is um, a ground type as well as a rock type. Yes. So hopefully that will help us out a little bit, even though I don't believe she has any ground type moves. That is correct. As of right now, she has like tackle, defense curl, and mud sport. Okay. But... I would like to try and level these guys up a decent amount before going to the gym, but I don't know how much uh, to do that. I don't know what makes sense for that. Okay. Um, well, we can... Sorry, go ahead. Yeah, that's kind of it. I okay. Think. Um, I think we walked around a fair amount in the city last time or the town or whatever you want to call it yeah orberg city it is a city um so we didn't go to the museum right I and then want to do and then going up here this just tells you you're in orberg we didn't go up this way either right. there's some grass there's some people so um there's also i believe you can also go south so where do you want to go today? Do you want to go north? Do you want to go to the museum? you want to go south? Well, well let's start with the museum. Sure. Uh, and then we can hang out in that grass for a decent period of time and, and level ourselves up. You got it. All right. Whoa. So this is coal? I never expected something this big. Look at that <laughs> massive piece of coal. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> wow. The Pokemon that carried this must be terribly strong. Pokemon carried it? I guess so. Uh, I wonder if we can Slave read. labor. <laughs> Slave labor, yeah, basically. Um, they just made them use strength, you know. Well, how about that? The Orberg Mine extends under the sea floor. That seems unsafe. I like how they said that the mine was, like, entirely automated. And then, like, they're like, oh, well, a uh, Pokemon <laughs> brought this gigantic piece of coal here because, <laughs> like, is that what you mean by automated? Like, you're just <laughs> using Pokemon as if sure. they're machines? Sure. Like, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> so this says, how coal is made one in a time long before history, vegetative matter was swept along by rain and rivers. It came to be buried under the ground. How coal is made two. The buried plant matter was forced ever deeper under the ground due to tremors and fissures caused by the shifting land masses. Cool. How coal is made three. Deep under the ground, the plant matter was subjected to heavy pressure and the heat of magma. It gradually turned into coal. Okay. Different kinds of lamps are displayed. They appear to have been worn on someone's head while underground. Badly scarred wooden tools are displayed. They apparently dug out coal using these tools in the olden days. And the everyday items and tools of past mine workers are displayed. Then in here, samples of coal from different regions. And the box contains categorized samples of coal. 
I find that very interesting. As though humans uh, didn't uh, invent uh, metal tools, <laughs> right? <laughs> like until after they started like heavily mining coal. <laughs> it's like, yeah, no, I don't really think that's how that went. <laughs> I mean, I wasn't there, but <laughs> wasn't. Yeah, well, that's fair. You want to talk to the lady or the man behind the counter? Uh, the lady, please. Hello, welcome to the Orberg Mining Museum. Okay, and he says, hello, hello, how are you? I study Pokemon fossils, me, right here and now. On the verge of a breakthrough I am to achieve extraction from fossils. From fossils, I can extract Pokemon, but not yet, not yet. Okay. So don't say you can do it. <laughs> can we talk about this what hiker's- about Harry Potter here? We talked to him already. Oh. Talk about this hiker's eyes, look at his eye. Yeah. It's huge now. That's better. <laughs> See, like that's what I was expecting. But when you go up here, it's like massive and terrifying. Uh, he's opening his eyes really wide. He's trying to see you. <laughs> yeah, well. All right, he's so we checked out the museum. You. Do you want to go north or south? North. North. Okay. Let's hang out in the graves. We're happy with Geodude up top for leveling? Yes. You got it. All right, so the grass. This is Route 207, Orberg City to the south. So there's a trainer there, or there's grass. Oh, let's start with the grass. Oh, okay, sorry. There's an item. Nice. Wow, we went through all of that. <laughs> we found a Pokeball. Nice. Also, look at the top of the screen. <gasps> Berries. Can't get up there right now, though. That's so okay. Oh, well. I was going to see if there was something hidden here, but first, it's a Machop. Nice, okay. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Uh, well, I mean, our attacks are Tackle, Defense, Curl, or Mud Sport. Yeah, no. Um. Um. Tackle, I guess. Low Kick. It's super effective. <laughs> Did eight points of damage. We tackle it and do that much. Okay, well, let's switch. Solid choice to whom? Because we did a thing with Geodude, and that's good enough. Yeah. <laughs> um, well, we don't have any psychic or flying. I mean, Zubat's flying, we just don't have a flying type attack. Yeah. But we have flying well, type I guess Pokemon. we can put Zubat in then. Okay. Kind of forgot about that. <laughs> uh, still mad that we have Zubat. Um, <laughs> but that's fine. Uh, Machop used Leer and lowered our defense. Zubat has Leech Life or Supersonic. Leech Life. Okay. It does. That much. Oh, God. It's not very effective. All right. Well, let's do Supersonic then. You got it. First <laughs> is a low kick, which does one damage. It's not very effective. Good. We supersonic. Boom! I went right to Machop's crotch. <laughs> Ding! Yeah, that would confuse me as well. <laughs> Why are you wearing a bell near my penis? I don't understand what's happening. <laughs> <laughs> it hurt itself in its confusion. Nice. Okay, fight or switch. I was confused too. <laughs> um, <laughs> let's uh, switch. Um... I don't know who we're switching to. I guess just... Ugh, oh, God. <laughs> Who's got what again? Shinx has... Shinx has... Tackle. Tackle and Leer and uh, Charge. Cricketot has... Bide. Bide and Growl. Let's let's put Cricketot out. Because... Bide'll be good against a fighting type, probably, right? So they do a lot of damage with their attacks. They they try when they're not confused, we'll see. Yeah. It got off a low kick on switching. Two damage. It's not very effective because we're a bug. Oh, okay. But that doesn't say oh, it does say that here. Damn it. Okay. Um What the hell, man? I don't know. <laughs> We can bide or we can switch. Well, 
Let's switch again. Oh, wow. So stupid. Okay. Are we uh, fainting this machop or catching it, by the way? <sighs> okay. Good, good answer. Good answer. Good answer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's great. I'm doing just great. Um, I think we are catching it. Oh, okay. Uh, we will replace Zubat with it. Okay. <laughs> so then who comes in? Uh, do we keep Krikatot in or switch to somebody else? Let's um, switch to... Let's uh, let's switch to Piplup, um, so we can do like one decent hit on it, and then try to catch it maybe. Okay. Machop is confused, and use Leer to lower our defense. Okay. Let's use Bubble. Is that gonna kill it? Yeah, you're eight levels stronger than it. You want to use a stab water move? Alright. <laughs> Pound? It's probably your best bet. You still think it's gonna die from that? It might. It's just still in the green. I'm just trying to do like a decent amount of damage in one hit. Okay. It's up to you. Leave a little bit left so okay. we can catch it. But if you think it's gonna die, we'll do something else. Okay. Do you think it's gonna die? I, I mean, I can't be sure, but because Piplup has kind of crappy attack, but you're eight levels higher than it. Yeah, that's kind of a lot. Yeah, almost three times. It's level. all right. Fine, we'll take Piplup back too. Oh God! <laughs> okay. <It's> so stupid. <laughs> this is the dumbest shit ever. All right. all right. Who comes in? I guess Badoo, because it's the only one left. <laughs> And we'll absorb it. <laughs> this Machop is getting a tour de force of our team. It snapped out of confusion. It used Leer to lower our defense. Uh, and we will use Absorb. Oh, okay. That did a decent amount. Mm -hmm. uh... Low kick. Not very effective. Two damage. And it was poisoned. Oh, nice. All right, so I don't even think we have to do more damage to it before we catch it. It's hurt by the poison. Okay, perfect. Let's catch this baby. Okay. Uh, Pokeball, Premier Ball, Dusk Ball, Heal Ball, Great Ball. Great Balls of Fire. So glad we're back to that. That's <laughs> great. <laughs> um... We're near the center, right? We're, like, right near it. Uh, I mean, we may encounter one more Pokemon coming out of this grass, but otherwise, yeah. All right, let's just use a Pokeball. I was just thinking of maybe it, using the Heal Ball. Also, it doesn't it, it doesn't matter. You have six Pokemon, so he's going to go straight to the PC. Oh, crap. Right? So right, you whatever. don't want to use a Heal Ball anyway. You don't want to use a Heal Ball anyway. That's right. That's why I told you that you don't, because <laughs> I don't you either. Don't. <laughs> yes, that's right. I don't. You caught it. Gotcha. The chop was caught. Okay. Uh, you're gonna. There we go. Machop's data was added to the Pokedex. Nice. Okay. Machop, the superpower Pokemon, obviously a fighting type, two foot seven inches tall and weighs forty three pounds. It hefts a Graveler repeatedly to strengthen its entire body. Nice. It uses every type of martial arts. Nickname, no. Was transferred to box one in someone's PC. Yeah, okay. There was an item here. Oh, it nice. was a Pokeball. Nice. You want to keep going in this grass or go get the Machop? No, let's go get the Machop. Okay. As I said, as we're leaving, we run into at least one more. It is... Another Geodude, level 7 this time. We send out our level 5 Geodude. Fight, switch, or run. <laughs> Why is this hard? 
Well, they're rocks, Amy. <laughs> That's not funny. Oh, damn it. I was about to say, hopefully somebody at home laughed at that, because... No, they didn't. Wow. Leave it in the comments. What are you thinking about? <sighs> <laughs> I'm thinking about putting Badoo in. Because it's a grass type? Yes. Okay. And we will, ab well, we'll growth and then absorb. Oh, okay. Geodude used defense curl. So it's defense rose, which is irrelevant in this case. We will growth once and raise our special attack. Defense curl. can absorb. Ha! Nice. Super effective. It. Yes. We went back to full health, of course, because we drained an entire Geodude. The wild Geodude fainted. Geodude gained 36, and Badoo gained 36. Very nice. And Badoo grew to level 10. Yeah. Which means 31 HP, 11 attack, 13 defense, 15 special attack, 19 special defense, and 16 speed. And Badoo learned Stun Spore. Ooh, okay. Very nice. Let's go back to the center. We actually get to uh, take a Pokemon out of this PC. And put one in, of course, but still. All right, uh, we will go to someone's PC. We will move Pokemon. And so you want to swap this Zubat for this Machop, correct? Yes. Level five Machop. Still not keeping these two, but... Whoops. They'll no, be I... um, effective Sorry. against this gym. Uh... And we can hopefully catch a couple more that we did not have in another generation of right. this game. Okay. Uh, let's see how our team looks. Geodude could use a little pick-me-up since we're standing right here. There's just no reason not to. Right. Thank you for waiting. We've restored your Pokemon to full health. We hope to see you again. Okay. Okay, so uh, back in the grass to train and or look for more pokes? Yes. It's a Geodude. Level six. We have our Geodude. Level five. Uh, fight or switch? Switch. Two. Badoo. Not Machop. Oh. What did we use Badoo against? We we did use Badoo against Geodude, but we didn't have Machop. Machop is also super effective against Geodude. It's up to you. If you want to level up Badoo, we can do that. No. Okay, Machop. We didn't even check out your Machop, actually. We didn't check its like nature or any of its abilities or anything. Obviously, we know it has Low Kick, which is a fighting type attack. So, uh, Defense Curl raises its defense. That's fine. Uh, so we have Low Kick or Leer. Low Kick. You got it. We use Low Kick, which does that much. Probably about a third. Yeah. Nice. Super effective. Geodude used Mud Sport. So, uh, if you were planning on using electricity against this ground-type Pokemon, you can't any longer. Oh, no. And by that, I mean you never could. Uh, low kick again. <laughs> Brings it to yellow. Now what? Just low kick it again? Yep. You got it. Defense Curl raises its defense. We low kick it in the face. 
and it still lives. Obviously, we'll finish it off with one more. Defense curl again, irrelevant. We're going to do way too much damage for that defense curl to be effective enough. And so, Geodude goes down, super effective. And our Geodude gains 31 and grows to level 6. Nice. So, 22 HP, 16 attack, 19 defense, 9 special attack, 8 special defense, and 8 speed. And Machop gained 31. Holy Whoa. crap. Okay. Well over half. Probably closer to 3 quarters. Um, Geodude up top or Machop up top? Uh... Still Geodude up top. Okay. Because then if we have to switch to Machop, okay. <laughs> they'll both be getting experience. Well, it's a Machop. Okay. And so we have our Geodude out. Fight or switch. So I suppose we should switch. I would agree with that statement, yes. So let's do it. Okay. Two. Um. I don't know. I guess my chop. Okay. Level 5 versus level 5. Oh, an armor chop is male. Okay. So Geodude's the only lady on the team. Oh, I thought... Zubat oh, was Zubat the other lady. Zubat was a lady. Yeah. Low kick, of course, or Leer? Uh, low kick. Okay. So we got hit with a low kick. It did uh, 6 damage. The chop used low kick. We got a 10. We'll low kick it again. Yeah. Okay. Staying relatively even. Ha! It stopped to use Leer. Nice. Okay. Kick it Let's again. Do it. Okay. This should do it. Speaking of do it, this should do it. It does. Okay. Nice. Machop fainted. Geodude gained 26. Machop gained 26. And Machop grew to level 6. Hmm. Hell yeah. 25 HP, 15 attack, 13 defense, 9 special attack and special defense, and 10 speed. And a little bit more. And in fact, now that I'm remembering to do so, let's check out your Machop. So Machop uh, has no item, has a lax nature, a sturdy body, and likes sour food. Hmm. It has, we, we just went over its um, stats. It has the ability No Guard. Ensures the Pokemon and its foe's attacks land. Ah. Uh, and then we know it has Low Kick and Leer. Okay. Uh, are we happy? Center, switching Pokemon up? How do we feel? Uh. We're happy. You got it. More in this grass? More in this grass. You got it. It's a wild Machop. Okay. Level five. We send out Geodude. Do we switch to Machop again? Yes. Okay. Uh, oh, Machop, it. Machop is half dead. Correct. So. Machop used Leer oh, good. to lower our defense. <laughs> uh, so we'll kick it. Yep. We're just kicking it with our homie over here. Gross. Yep, you're welcome. Almost half. Wow. There, Machop used low kick. No. And dealt nine damage to us. Okay, we survived it. <laughs> yes. Uh, if we attack again, we'll die. Uh, if he attacks again as well. Because he could use Leer. But he could. it's not. But let's not chance it. Makes sense. So switch two. Good do. Okay. 
the low kick would be not very effective on Badu, as we learned. It did like two damage the last time we took one from Amachop. There's the low kick, so we would have died. It did one damage this time, not very effective. So we, oh, and it poisoned. Uh, yeah. Beautiful. Badu is great. Right? Okay. Uh, absorb Growth Stun Spore. Well, we can't use Stun Spore here. Or uh, Water Spore. Uh, let's use Absorb. You got it. Yeah, Poison Point and Stun Spore are not the best combo in the world. Yeah. But if you know it's not going to be using any, like, physical attacks for whatever reason, it might work in your favor to, um, to try to paralyze it. Plus, Poison and Paralysis, like, Poison does damage over time, which is helpful. Um, but paralysis means that sometimes they won't attack and also that they're slower. So it just yeah. it's like a trade-off of what you want versus what's possible since uh, at least the poison point sometimes triggers and it has to be on a physical attacking uh, move hitting. Mm -hmm. So Geodude gained 18 or 17, excuse me, and grew to level 7. Nice. Wow. 24 HP, 18 attack, 22 defense. 10 special attack, 8 special defense, and 9 speed. Machop gained 17, and Badu gained 17. Nice. Okay. Okay. More in here? Yeah. It's a Machop. Level 5. We send out Geodude level 7. Switch to... Do. Badu comes in, just absorb or something else? Um, yeah, just absorb. Okay. One damage, not very effective, and it gets poisoned. Nice. Hell yeah, poison point. Putting in work. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we'll absorb. That was oh a crit. Oh my gosh. <laughs> wow. That was a good crit. All right, Leer lowers our defense, but it shouldn't matter between the poison damage this time and the absorb damage that we're about to do. That should be the end of this Machop. Pretty nice. <clears throat> but yes, I agree with you. Badu is uh, doing pretty well right now. Yeah. All right, so Machop fainted. Geodude gained 26. Badu gained 26. So is Badu one of those Pokemon that you're afraid, like, when it evolves, you're not going to like it? Because it's, like, so cute? No. Okay. Are you saying that because it's ugly? No. Okay. I am not. Good. It's a Zubat. There are other things in this grass, but we have a Geodude. Yeah. Okay. Of course we don't have any rock-type moves. Of course not. But we have <laughs> Tackle, Defense Curl, or Mud Sport. All right, so Tackle. Zubat used Leech Life and did a whole one point of damage. We use a Tackle and do that much damage. Okay. Let's just do that a bunch of times. Supersonic Mist. Ooh, Thank nice. God. Give it a little bit of a reprieve for us. Ooh, critical hit Tackle on yeah. Geodude, or from Geodude. Zubat used Leech Life. Nice. Deals another one point of damage. Correct. Restores a little bit of health to itself, but not enough. Tackle finishes it off. Very nice. Solo kill for Geodude. I think that may be the first one. Geodude gained 46. Got Sick. there. And grew to level 8. Very nice. Okay. 26 HP, 19 attack, 24 defense, 11 special attack, and 9 special defense and speed. And Geodude learned rock polish. The hell is that? He's getting his rocks polished, you know. Rock polish, let's go take a look. Rock polish is a rock type move. The user polishes its body to reduce drag it can sharply raise the speed stat. Uh-huh. So it gives itself plus two speed if you use rock polish. 
it polishes itself, Amy. Anyway, uh, how do you so feel? It's a turd. How do you feel about this? <laughs> Nicely done. How do you feel about this lineup? Uh. Order and health. Well, I'd like to fix up my chop so that I can keep leveling. Okay. It's only at level six. Correct. It is your lowest by two levels right now. Um, all right, so we'll go to the center. Do you want Geodude still up top? No, I'd rather have Machop up top. Okay. Because it's it's two lo levels lower than the Geodude. And yeah. You got it. Geodude is like three levels lower than my other Pokemon, so... Uh, it's one level lower than your Crick top, but... Okay. But regardless, I completely understand uh, either way what you're saying. And so, let's go back up to the grass. Okay. And we find a wild... Zubat. Of course. <laughs> okay. Fight or switch. We learned that low kick against Zubat is not very effective when right. this Machop that we we're trying to catch used it against our Zubat, so. Okay. What's his other move? Leer. Lowering defense. Oh. Okay, never mind. Let's switch out. You got it. Two? Uh, Geodude. Makes sense to me. And we will tackle or whatever movie he's got. The lady of the team. Oh, yeah. Supersonic. Now she's very confused. Okay. Uh, tackle, defense curl, mud sport, rock polish. Yeah, tackle. You got it. Supersonic again. Obviously, it doesn't work because we're already confused. We're confused. And we hurt ourselves. Does four damage. Supersonic fails again. Thanks, Zubat. We're confused. And we hurt ourselves. Four more. Supersonic fails. Nice. We're confused. And we hurt ourselves. Three in a row. We love doing that in this game, man. It's super annoying. Leech Life. Does. One whole point, but brings us into the yellow. Not We're confused. Great. And we get off a tackle, finally. Only took four tries. Didn't even... Well, it did a third. Easily a third. Keep going. Tackle. You got it. Supersonic. Failed. Does that mean we snapped out of confusion? That's what Sick. I was waiting for. All right. Tackle. Brings it low enough that one more hopefully will do it. Leech life. Good. Good attack. For us. Down to 12. Up one point for Zubat. Tackle. Does finish it off. Nice. That's cook. A long time, but it, it sure did. is done. Machop gained 23. Geodude gained 23. Okay. We find a wild Geodude. Very nice. Because that Machop being up top is going to be very helpful here. <clears throat> we have Machop level 6. You want to just kick it? Yep. Over half. In fact, almost two thirds. Mud sport. There you go. Mm -hmm. Sorry, we can't Very use our electric threatening. moves anymore. It sucks. Actually, it doesn't even mean we can't use them anymore. It just means its power would be weakened, but Geodude wouldn't have let us use them anyway. A crit. Thanks, Machop. Super effective. Geodude faints. Machop gains 52. Grows to level 7. And therefore gets 28 HP, 17 attack, 14 defense, 9 special attack and special defense, and 10 speed. And learned focus energy. And went more than halfway to level 8. Wow. 
We run into a wild Geodude. Fantastic. Okay. More of that. Level five. Okay. More kicks. Yeah. Why not? Worked so well the last time. Kick. Still over half. Super effective. Defense curl. Good. Defense rose. Low kick. Finishes it off. Easy enough. Super effective. Geodude fainted. Machop gained 52. We're going to level 8. Nice. It's quick. Okay. Uh, 30 HP, 19 attack, 16 defense, 10 special attack and special defense, and 11 speed. And then a little bit more towards level 9. We run into a wild Geodude. This is great. It's farm yeah. Geodudes, huh? Yeah. Alright. Um, Just kick it. You got it. Now kick, now kick, now kick, now kick. Anyway. <laughs> uh, I look forward to the... Um, to the copyright claim for how accurate my singing just oh, was to yeah. that song. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 Alright, we did it. Geodude fainted. We get another 52 on the chop. Okay. We're more than halfway to level 9. Uh, how you feeling? We're good? Keep going? Geodude be healed. Okay. We are near the bottom. That's kind of why I asked before I like went deeper into the grass where we'd have to then fight our way out, you know? Yes. Okay. Let's rest up. So you want Geodude to be healed, but you still are okay with Machop up top? Top yeah. chop? Okay. Mm -hmm. Good. <laughs> All right. Hope to see you again. We can leave. Perfect. All right. We run into a wild Geodude. Okay. Fantastic. We'll level seven Geodude. Very nice. All right, Machop. Let's see what you got. We're level eight, so let's kick it. Over half. Oh. Super effective. Love it. Mud sport. Oh no. What are we gonna do? <laughs> Our whole strategy <laughs> is to gonna use make mud <laughs> electricity. Low kick. And that's it. Alright. Guess Machop's going to level 9. What do you think? Yeah. Geodude fainted. Machop gained 73. And is now level 9. Very nice. 33 HP, 21 attack, 17 defense, 11 special attack and special defense, and 12 speed. Woo! And a little bit more. I like it. Okay, keep going? Yeah. It's another Geodude. Level 6 this time. Okay. So, better than the fives we've been fighting, but not as good as the seven that we just found, but still. Low kick. Whoa, nice. Over, over half. In fact, probably three quarters. Mud Sport, again. Thank you, Geodude. You're making it easy. Okay. We will finish it with another low kick. Critical hit. Thanks, Machop. Super effective. God, it's so annoying when the Pokemon do that. <laughs> Geodude fainted. Machop gained 62. Pretty nice. Yeah. Okay. How you feeling? Keep going. Switch things up. Go talk to the trainer. Go south. Stay here. Got lots of options. I just want to remind you that, you know, I'm not trying to advocate for leaving here if you want to stay. 
I just want to know, you know, I, I need you to let me know when you want to do something different, that's all. Hmm. Yeah, I think I want to keep training up a little bit. Okay. I'd like all the others to be at level 10 with Badoo. Oh, okay. Well, here's the Geodude that will hopefully put, uh, oh yeah, level 7. Yep. Machop should be level 10 then after this. So, low kick. Take two of these again, I guess. Take two, call me in the morning. Yep, there's one. Super effective. Geodude use tackle. Three damage. We actually have not been damaged on a chop in a while. The Geodudes have been using, like, you know, mud sports and defense curls yeah. and stuff. Okay, low kick number two finishes it off. Geodude faints. A chop gains 73. And grows to level 10. Nice. 35 HP, 23 attack, 18 defense, 12 special attack and special defense, and 13 speed. And Machop learned Karate Chop. Yeah. More fighting type attacks. Okay. Uh, so then you want to switch Machop out of the front? Yeah. And switch with whom? Geodude, Geodude. or Cricket Top? Geodude, okay. 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 And we find a wild Geodude. Damn it, man. All right, who are we switching to? Well, this is only a level five. We could try to fight with Geodude if you want. It's just gonna be a long, arduous process, but it's up to you. I mean, I guess we could put Krikatot in. Okay. Okay, so we take Geodude out, we put Krikatot in. Geodude used Mud Sport, which is a good thing for it to use before we use Bide, right. instead of after. And so we're using Bide, I assume? Yeah. You got it, we use Bide, angrily. Geodude used Tackle, very nice. Dealt four damage to us. The <laughs> The Quick Claw lets us go first to store energy, which we would have done anyway, but still, that's fine. Geodude used Tackle again. Thanks, Geodude, you're helpful. And another four damage, so that's eight, so we should do 16 here as we unleash energy with the Quick Claw. Yep, yes. very close. Defense Curl, good move to use in between the Bides, Geodude, nice. All right, Bide again? Yeah. You got it. We use Bide. Geodude use Defense Curl. We only need to get hit once. So there's that. We're storing energy. And Geodude use Defense Curl. Okay. Huh. We'll try again. No harm, no foul. It raising its defense does nothing against us using our Bide. So yeah. we unleashed energy, but it failed. Now it tackles us. Deals four more. Now we can bite again. Quick Claw lets us go first. Geodude used Mud Sport, but it failed. It's onto our tricks, Amy. We're storing energy. And Geodude used Tackle. Thanks, Geodude. We're good. Down to 11, but we unleash energy. Yeah, we do. And finish it off. Bye, Geodude. <laughs> Geodude gained 26, and Crick Attack gained 26. Not quite. Almost. Okay. What do we think? Still good? Um, yeah, I think still good. You got it. Okay. Okay. We run into a wild Machop. So Geodude, as we know, will not have a great time here, but we can switch to Krikatot if you want. Yes. It won't be super easy, but we can try it. Or Machop. Or Machop. I thought you. I just thought you said you wanted them. Yeah. I mean, it, I guess it doesn't matter. Sure. You want Machop? Yeah. You got it. 
Geodude comes out, Machop comes in, Low Kick, Karate Chop, Leer, or uh, Focus Energy? Uh, karate Chop. Okay. So our defense goes down. We will Karate Chop. You like that animation? No, like just that's weird. A what? critical hit. Whoa. Brings it to like one health. Leer lowers our defense. And so what do you want to do? Uh, well. We have more karate chops than low kicks, but it's whichever you choose to finish it off. Yeah, let's just do that. You got it. And karate chop is a crit again. Damn, the chop. We didn't even use focus energy on you. Jesus. Geodude gained 37. Machop gained 37. Oh, that's right. It's Karate Chop. Does it tell you that? Because I've thought... I've been talking about this for... Since Red. What? That Karate Chop's uh, crit rate is massive. The foe is attacked with a sharp chop. It has a high critical hit ratio. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> anyway. God damn it. I just knew it. Because we, we got critted all the time in Red with Karate Chop. It was like all the time. So you just critted twice in a row with yours, so yeah. that's what made me think of it. We run into a wild... Machop again. Same thing, switch to Machop or switch to somebody else. Uh, switch to Machop. You got it. Judo comes out, Machop comes in. More Karate Chops. Yeah. Leer lowers our defense. Okay. We will Karate Chop. Actually, that's an interesting question that I wanted to ask folks in chat. That was very close and not a critical hit. Low kick. Because we, we are running into a situation here where, so far in this game, we've caught... We had our starter Pokemon. We had three unique Pokemon that we've never seen before that are on our team that Amy right. enjoyed, as well as like others that we didn't catch. Geodude grew to level nine, by the way. Nice. Uh, 28 HP, 21 attack, 26 defense, 11 special attack, nine special defense, and 10 speed. Machop gained 26 as well, and we'll keep going. Um, but we are also now running into the issue of Geodudes, Zubats, and Machops are relatively plentiful. Right. And we've seen them all already and so like it's not as intriguing it's like a, you know you want newer pokemon yeah. but if you want pokemon that will do well against these gyms you may end up needing to do that sorry are we switching to machop or are we switching to Cryptot uh, or whatever machop okay um okay so we take out geodude put machop in and then we'll just karate chop a bunch but um but yeah, I just find it interesting. Like, what do folks feel like in terms of, are there Pokemon that are just staples on your team? Like, you're like, look, I'm going to catch a Geodude every time. It's just what I'm going to do. Or, um, you know, whatever the bug type is, I'm always going to catch it in the first route that I can. Um, I'm just curious. I'm curious how, how people um, end up going about dealing with the start of the game before you can really get into, um, you know, finding variance in your choices because you're kind of limited towards the beginning to like whatever the flying type is whatever the normal type is at the beginning of the game right geodude and machop gain 26 okay keep looking around it's machop level five here's geodude Okay, we'll switch to Machop. All right. There, Machop used Low Kick, or the Wild Machop, I should say. Use Low Kick. We'll use Karate Chop. Not a crit. Leer lowers our defense. Irrelevant. Our defense falls, but we should be able to finish it off with a Karate Chop. Nice. Very good. Critical hit that time. Okay, well. 
whatever. Machop fainted. Geodude gained 26. Machop gained 26. Okay. We run into a wild Geodude. Level 6. We send out our Geodude. Fight or switch. Uh, switch, please. To Machop again. What was my chop at? 10. Um, let's Level 10. Okay. Take out Geodude, put in Krikatot. Geodude used Tackle to bring us to 6. That dealt 5 damage. If you look at how much experience it needs to level up, mm. it should be okay if we just switch it out okay. for anything else. Who do you want to put in instead? Uh. Do. You got it. Badoo is in. We will use Absorb. Geodude used Mud Sport. Thanks, Geodude. You're the best. Electricity's power, of course, was weakened. Oh no, our strategy. Here's Absorb to finish Whoa. off. Yeah. All right. Super effective. I did not think it was going to go that far. I did. <laughs> I'm glad we did it. The Wild Geodude fainted. Our Geodude gained 20. Badoo gained 20. And Krikatot gained 20. And Krikatot is now level 10. Nice. 29 HP, 14 attack, 11 defense, 10 special attack, 14 special defense, and 10 speed. And that's... Oh! What? Krikatot is evolving. <gasps> Did not know it evolved so early. I didn't remember, I should say. <laughs> Congratulations, your Krikatot evolved into Krikatoon. Nice. Okay. Krikatoon learned Fury Cutter. Ooh, yes. Bug type moves, baby. All right. It's a good one, too. It's pretty good. All right, so let's check out your Krikatoon. What do you think of the design? Hate it, like it? I like it. I like that he keeps dancing. <laughs> So, now it has 27 attack, or sorry, 37 HP, 27 attack, 13 defense, 16 special attack and special defense, and 18 speed, and its ability is Swarm, powers up bug-type moves in a pinch. Mm, nice. And as you know, it now has Growl, Bide, and Fury Cutter. Can we move these things around? We can't, right? Or can we? Oh, we can. Ha! Ha! Beautiful. Okay. All right. Uh, keep going. Or to the center. We just need to get Geodude to level 10 now, if that's what you want. Yeah. Okay. Do you want to go to the dude down here, or just stay in the grass? Let's go to the trainer. Okay. That slope's too slippery. You'll need a bike to get up. You don't have a bicycle? There's a cycle shop in Eterna City. That's all he's here to tell you, because you you sh you can try to go up this slope, but then you slide back ah. down. But if you have a bike, you can go right up. So, okay. Uh, grass or uh, go south? Grass. There we go. We find a wild... Geodude. <laughs> Level 5. Okay. Fight or switch? Uh, fight. Sure. Uh, tackle, defense curl, mud sport, rock polish. Tackle. Just gonna make a bunch of sparks. Just have the rocks smash into <laughs> each other over and over again. Mm, no, if we had rock smash, that would be cool. <laughs> yes. All right, so we did that much. It's not very effective. Their Geodude, the wild Geodude, used defense curl. We'll just keep tackling. 
okay? Like I said before, it'll take a while, but we will win this after a while. Unless they get, like, really lucky with crits, even if they put their defense really high, because we're still four levels higher, so. And we're getting a pretty good head start here. Ugh. That was a low amount of damage. Tackle. Does one. <laughs> so. <laughs> Tackle. Does one. Tackle. Does one. Yep. Like I said, the only thing that's going to be different now is um, if anybody crits, but even if, like, again, we're still very far ahead. Still not very effective. Don't care. Tackle us for one. We tackle them. I f no, that one definitely did one. I was going to say, I feel like some of these attacks are doing two from us, but not all of them. Uh, Mud Sport lowers electricity's power. Tackling more. Yeah, like that. I don't know. That's hard to tell. But down into the yellow. Defense curl again. But if we're only doing one damage a turn, it's irrelevant how high they make their defense. So tackle again. Okay. I just don't want to have to share this experience. I wholeheartedly agree with you. It sucks, but you're. I think you're making the right call. And obviously, what I think is all that matters. Right. <laughs> Thankfully, there's nobody watching this right now who could possibly give their opinions in some sort of commentary fashion. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Leave it in the comments or, you know what? Like this video if you have ever uh, smashed a rock into another rock in Pokemon <laughs> like this. <laughs> Just over and over again trying to get that sweet, sweet experience. God knows I have. In fact, <laughs> I think I told this story before. There was a, there was a trainer in silver in a cave who had like a level 2 Geodude, a level 4 Geodude, and a level 6 Geodude. And I had a level 2 Geodude as well. And I'm pretty sure I just made... Uh, I, I must have used potions or something. But I used my Geodude to kill his first one. Yeah. So his level 2 went down and my level 2 grew to like level 3 or 4. Mm -hmm. And then I beat his level 4 and my Geodude grew to level 4. And then I beat his level 6 and my Geodude grew to like five or six. Nice. So it took forever, but God knows it was worth it. Worth so it. yeah, exactly. Does this do it? Yeah, it does. Critical hit. Jesus, Geodude, you son of a bitch. Uh, all right. The wild Geodude fainted. Our Geodude gains 52. Oh no. So close. Try again. Level. Not yet. It's like five points away or something ridiculous. Jeez. Like, hey, a Geo dude. <laughs> this God. this experience we can share, and it's a level seven, so okay. we can just switch to Machop and finish this yeah, off properly. Let's do that. <laughs> you got it. Okay. Put in Machop. Karate chops are good. Yeah. You got it. Uh, Pork chops are good. Nice. Mm -hmm. Pork chops are good. I would say I could go for a pork chop right now, but it's late enough in the night where I don't need that in my life at this exact moment. Um, sure you do. Nah. I'm waking up at 2 a.m. to shit. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'm good, thanks. Yeah, just right in the pit of my stomach as I try to fall asleep. Yeah. A full pork chop. <laughs> hey, that's not a ton of food. One pork chop. That's yeah. not a ton of food. Fair point. But still, no thank you. All right, let's finish this thing off and get our Pokemon leveled up to where we want them to be. And it was a level 7 to finish off, which is nice. I appreciate that. So Geodude faints. Our Geodude gains 36 and grows to level 10. Nice. Which means 30 HP, 23 attack, 29 defense, 12 special attack, 9 special defense, and 10 speed. And Machop gained 36 and also grew... To level 11. Yes. 38 HP, 25 attack, 19 defense, 12 special attack, 13 special defense, and 14 speed. Very nice. Love this. Okay. All right. Very sweet. Let's heal up, and then I feel pretty confident about this gym. Well, you still have to go to the mine, because... In the mine! In the mine, where a million diamonds shine... 
If you know where that song is from, which you should, but, you know, some people don't, uh, leave it in the comments. Anyway, we hope to see you again. Okay, uh... Are we supposed to go to the mine before the gym? We have to. Uh, Rourke isn't in the gym. He's in the mine. Oh. And uh, Flock is standing in front of the gym until we go to the mine. Ugh. He tells us to do so. Because he's a douchebag. I, I mean, no? Yes? Anyway, guess when, when we'll be doing that in the next episode. Because we are done for now. That was a hell of a training session, Amy. And yeah. hey, you got your first evolution. Yeah. Cricketot evolved into Cricketoon. Are you happy? Yes. Good. Because Cricketot was one of the Pokemon that I was a little afraid would be really difficult to level because it didn't really have like an attack that sure. did anything. <laughs> sure. Absolutely. I, um, I hear that. Yeah. So I was worried that Cricketot would lag behind everybody else for a while. Okay. But with that evolution, I feel a lot better. So. Yeah, it's evolved and it's got uh, the Fury Cutter bug type stab move. Yeah, it's great. Um, the only problem is if you're going up against a rock type gym, you probably don't want to use the bug type, but you'll so. you'll have it for follow-ups, yeah. et cetera, which is great. So nicely done today, Amy. Uh, please, folks, feel free to leave your congrats or your thoughts anything at all down in the comments below we've mentioned yes. multiple things that you could talk about down there and you know you don't have to do one of our prompted suggestions talk about whatever the heck you want but uh that is gonna be the end of this particular ugly you are yeah because you could definitely see me right now um but anyway <laughs> uh feel free to uh do all that other fun youtube stuff as well It'll help you out a lot if you subscribe and ring that bell so that you will get notifications whenever any of our videos come out, including the continuation of this series next week. Because we will be back next week with more of this, we also have other channels and other series, so we encourage you to check those check out. Check them out. Links down in the description box below, and thank you in advance for doing any and all of those things, liking, sharing, etc. But for now, from us here at the Geek for All family of channels, I have been Joe. And I'm Amy. And as we always say, in whichever video of ours you watch next, we will see you all next time. Thanks, everybody. <laughs>